Hello everybody, we are here today at Automatica in Munich and there are many examples here around us that shows automation and robotics are really improving business for many companies. And companies that actually has never used robots can now easily work with them thanks to innovation in hardware and software. And today I'm joined by Milton, who is the president of Shook. Milton and I have been discussing how robots are becoming more common in the workplace and what that means for students who will join the workplace in the future. Milton, what do you think? Well, you know, companies must deploy automation and robotics, Marina, to both retain and excite their, their employees and free, their, free the capacity and make sure that they're ready for other more cognitive tasks. Therefore, it is important that we prepare the next generation to deal with this technology. Today, students have a very different expectation. You know, they have a different foundation of both education and experience, and they've been dealing with technology all of their lives. So now we need to, with robotics and automation, we can provide them a better or a more interesting career. And I would say I have noticed the students are really excited to working with these new technologies and particularly with robots. So I would say robots are the perfect way to encourage students to explore the opportunities in STEM and education. And all around the world, we are talking about AI and machine learning. And these are concepts that are very attractive to students. And I really think this is an opportunity that we commonly must tap into. Or what do you think? You know, AI and machine learning is touching our lives in so many ways, more and more each day. And robotics is actually a bridge to the physical world. And what student wouldn't be interested in having that link to the thing, how things are made and that be part of their career? So I ask you, how can we make sure that they're ready for the future? It's a good question. And I mean, there are examples today already of schools who are incorporating robots into their curriculum. And there is still a gap though between the skills needed by the industry and what the schools actually teach today. And currently, most education institutions, they actually lack robotics training. And even though there is an increased demand in the industry then for workers who are skilled in automation, and this is, I think, where we really must focus on. So ABB is working to bridge this skill gap and works actively with educators all around the world to help students to really learn the fundamentals of robotics and automation. Yeah, so ABB's commitment to education and training is really tremendous. I think we're equally devoted and we're finding that we're providing these real world examples. So at Shunk, we deployed Colabs all over the world. And when we did that, we had a kind of a goal in mind of being able to make trials for customers and also prove out small applications. But what we found was this is also a way to engage students. So in most of our Colabs, a lot of our trainees are actually engaged with robotic cells, much like what you guys have developed for education, but also working on real world application examples that come in from our customers. That's really interesting. And I think this importance of training is to be easy to understand for the teachers, so it's easy to learn it for the students is really important. Like this new ABB Robotics Education Package that you see here behind me. And this cell, it really uses our easy and safe GoFa. It's a collaborative robot on which students can then learn real life industrial application like material handling. And this cell is only one part of the package. It also includes the course material and a STEM certificate that students can then present to future employers anywhere in the world. The education package that we see here what you said I think is exactly what educators need. It's much more than just hardware. It's actually the software, the curriculum, the entire package. And I think having a collaborative robot and a certified gripper together bring a very safe environment for the students to learn and also come up with real world examples. Yes, ABB is taking this collaboration with Shunk to a whole new level. And Shunk is one of our many partners in our new robotics ecosystem program. And these are ready-to-go solutions using certified third-party equipment, such as Shunk scrippers, software, and other packages. And this ecosystem program makes automation much faster and simpler than ever before. And I'm really excited for how we can work together to open up automation opportunities 
for the present and even more important for the future of work. Marina, as we say at Shunk, hand in hand for tomorrow. Thank you for inviting me here. It's been a real pleasure. Thank you also very much.